Oh yeah. What's today, Asher? Where do we go on Sundays? We go to church. To church. <laughs> Callie, you coming to help? Yeah. <laughs> All right, go ahead, Asher. That's our last one. You got it. Oh, you okay? A Sunday morning here on our Toopstead and as you saw here Asher helped me this morning bright and early cooking pancakes at 6 a.m. because Callum decided to wake us up at 5. <laughs> We're still trying to get on a good schedule but I took care of the baby and then Asher woke up about 30 minutes later. I cooked breakfast with Asher. We no longer turn the TV on first thing in the morning. We will have him stay in the kitchen with me and play in the kitchen with toys. No TV until after we eat and he can watch TV while I get ready. Cody actually goes downstairs in the garage and reads his Bible and works out and then what we have been doing is I'll get the breakfast cooked with the boys and then he'll come up and relieve me and then I will get to read my Bible and devotional and then work out and it's been working out really well and we do it about every day <laughs> even if we don't work out every day we at least try and read God's Word every day in the morning because it starts us off right Sundays can be a little bit hectic Cody goes to worship practice early um, at our church and so he's usually there about an hour and a half before we are so that can be a little stressful for mom <laughs> but thankfully I've been on a really good routine of Callum Calm's already down for his nap, so me and Asher will leave after Calm wakes up. And right now I have about 45 minutes to just clean up and spend a little bit of time with Asher before we leave for church. These are the pancakes Asher helped me with. We made way more than what was necessary, so I like that because that means that I probably won't have to cook breakfast for the next couple days. Made sure to make extra bacon and extra pancakes, so that'll make my life easier for those early morning wake-ups. this massive pot of jambalaya yesterday. Now I'm gonna freeze it up. Um, we ate on it for a meal last night for dinner, but this is something I've been trying to do at least two to three times a week, cooking way excess of a meal and then freezing several batches of it, trying to cut down on cost of our groceries because with inflation it's just been so crazy so I've actually found that if I cook in larger batches and save them it really helps with saving money <laughs> and I'm all for saving money this jambalaya turned out so good so this is a ginormous thing of it and it's got chicken and pork and sausage so good so I'm gonna freeze so probably at least three meals of this and then we'll have it after church as well And just like that, we have three freezer meals. <laughs> for me cooking just one meal, and it made five meals for my family. And check this out. We have babies. Look at those pretty Snapdragon babies growing. Yay! Those are the first seedlings I have started for the flower farm. I actually plan on putting them out in the flower beds come mid to late March, maybe early April, just depends how they look, but they're frost hardy. So I'm hoping to get them out there pretty quickly. Asher, why are you so tired this morning? But what, why are you making my hair? I gotta make your hair. Why? Well, cause you look really cute when it's spiked up, no. like cuter than you already do. No, I don't wanna do it right now. Oh, why not? I, because I wanna do it after I wake up. Okay. <laughs> you want a dance party? Dance party. Let's see the picture. Oh, you want to take a picture with Mama? Okay. I'll take a picture while we dance. While we dance? Okay. Asher, who are we going to go wake up? Come on, let's go wake up Callum. I'll be sweet and sneaky. Oh, gosh. Hey, Callum. So we made it home from church and I feel so lucky when this happens, but both boys are down for a nap at the same time, which like never happens. So I'm gonna be able to get some work done, which is great. And I wanted to mention, 
Yesterday was one of the first days we've ever done this. Um, we actually had put on Facebook Marketplace that we were selling some strawberry starts, like strawberry plant starts, because we have loads of them, probably like 800 or more that we can sell in our garden because they've just spread like crazy in the past two years. And we ended up having 50 sold yesterday. We sold them for $2 a piece. Then I get home from church and we have 20 more sold. So we made a little money this weekend. Kind of cool. <laughs> caramel latte when I get to sit down to work. <laughs> good thing I'm working out again, because I'm sure that all that cream would not be good for me if I weren't working out in the morning. Some of you may be wondering where Cody is. Hey! And we have worship night that they're practicing for this Wednesday. So yeah, I've had the kids all morning. I'm gonna show you another thing I've been working on. Some sourdough starter, my starter that I use for all my bread and any other recipes you see me using sourdough discard for, drying on the counter. And this is because I have started giving this away and I'm also selling it on Etsy. So you can go and look for some if you'd like some of your own on our Etsy store. A link will be in the description. So to make this vlog a little more entertaining, I'm just gonna share with you what I was told that my child decided to tell his Sunday school teacher this morning. The teacher asked, Asher, are those some new pants? I like your blue jeans. And he said, uh, no, these are so old. <laughs> Where does he get this up? And then he looks at her and says, can you tell how big I'm getting? He's getting big. He wants everyone to know. What are we doing? We're playing farm. We're playing farm. Is this goat been eating callum? The goat right here. He's been eating callum and Asher. So Asher decided to bring Mr. Goat a hay bale. Deliver it to him, Asher, before he eats callum up. Yum, 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 Get, what do we need the truck for? We need it to put it in there. To put it in the, okay, okay, go get the truck. Callum says, this goat's attacking me. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> nom, 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 Do you got something? You got a mule. Yeah. Go, Azure, go. The trailer. What about the trailer? We put a hay bale in it. Do you know where it is? Yeah. Man, you got more toys than you know what to do with. Yeah. Yeah. I'm blessed. Hey, yeah. Um, nom, 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 nom. Got another hay bale. The goat's gonna be so Mom. happy. Mom, he don't have to keep eating your hair. Come on. Mom, Mom. <laughs> Mom we've been looking for this. Oh yes, we have. Thank you. Asher's loading hay bales. Hey, you got the tractor? Hey, Asher, do you remember what God did on the seventh day? Remember, after He made everything, what did He do? He made light and yeah. dark. He made light and dark. Oh yeah, look at Callum. Asher, he rested. Do you think he thinks that we can play and rest in the same day? Oh yeah. yeah. You got the tractor? Okay, let's do it. One, two, three, go! Asher, what are we making? We're making brownies. Callum, do you want to eat brownies? So, I don't know. I don't know, I just want to eat What did you do? I did it. Farming and I grow it. Farming and I grow it. Who sings that? Peterson Farm Brothers. Peterson Farm Brothers, man. And, and I was... You're making music too? I'll do it. I'll cry with these tunes. Oh, are you a musician like your daddy? Yes. Oh, does he sound good? All right, let's make brownies. Say it, Patrick. Wash off the dirty stuff. Yeah. Okay. That's what you always do before you the cake. Oh, thanks for the tip. Chocolatey. It is chocolatey. Well, look who joined us for bath time. Oh, no, I'm not talking about daddy. <laughs> I'm talking about somebody. Why else. did you want to see this side? <laughs> Why, daddy? We got a bottle yeah. feed it. What kind of, what is it, girl or boy? Girl. Girl. Well, at least somebody on this farm can have girls. <laughs> yeah, daddy, what you holding money for? How do we make money? Strawberries. We're 20 strawberry plants, 40 bucks. Yeah. You guys so sweet. What are you saying? Sheep. The sheep. Was it pretty? Yeah. Yeah. Sheep. <laughs> Asher, do you think the sheep likes all the toys? Yeah. Now you're getting it all clean 
That's it for today's video. <laughs> Sorry, you guys, that I was not in the video very much. Not that y'all missed me. Yes, they did. Because these cuties here, I'm we sure, kept them. all of y'all occupied. I had practice at church yeah. that kept me after a little while. <laughs> and then whenever I got home, I was instructed I had some strawberry clients that wanted to buy some strawberries. So I had to dig up a bunch of strawberry plants. Then I had to bring the cows a hay bale and go check on the sheep and we actually had a baby out there. So now I am bottle feeding a baby because the mama's abandoned it. If you there want go. to, we have like a whole mamas. list of people that want our bottle baby. <laughs> yeah. I was doing some other gardening work and stuff and it was just too daggum cold. I had these thick, gloves on to keep my hands warm and I just couldn't do any filming so sorry about that you guys. Did y'all keep all our viewers busy today? Yeah I sure made pancakes this morning. What else brownies. did you make? We made brownies. Oh man what did you make? I little... made stinkers for mama to change. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. I made sweet faces. <laughs> God bless you guys. We will see y'all on the next one. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Whoa, 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 wait, stop. There's bonus footage. Don't go anywhere. Got something for y'all to play with. What? Yes. Yeah, you wanna play with it? Yeah. Hey, Kyle, look. Yeah, look at that.